process, as every other process. You know, it's it's been a moment of a great crisis. Uh, you know, at a personal level, it's people like you who've really gone through the trauma. You know, journalists will just report the story. But for you, is there a sense that you feel, that, you know, in the last 48 hours, I, I think you were trying to contact the government of India, the MEA, to get more information. Were yeah. you able to get the kind of information that you wanted? Well, um, I was not able to get the entire information, but what I got was a lot of awareness. People were putting me on to the right people. Uh, I got through to the army. So there was a lot of connection that I got through. So I would say the social media really helped. Because in this term of crisis, I, I really didn't know where to turn. And being a mountaineer, I knew exactly what was happening there in the mountain. Of course, not to that scale. But it was uh, absolutely crucial that I got help. Is, and, and, and what are you going to do? How are you and your husband going to celebrate once he's back? In a, is he back tomorrow? No, it's going to take him a couple of days. So he's at base camp at the moment, he's, he's base at, camp 3. No, he is at Gorakshe, which is uh, a step down to, as you're going down from the base camp. Right. He had to be away from the other lunch area. And he's right now, as of now that we speak, he's uh, in a tea house, probably sleeping. That's why he's not picking up the phone. <laughs> okay, well, either way, he's safe, which is a great end to the story. Yes. And uh, enjoy and celebrate when he's back. Yes. Uh, you know, it's, a, it's terrible because there's been so much of grief all around yes. that it's nice to know that there are people yes. who survived and lived to tell the tale. It was a very emotional moment for us because when he called and the last 48 hours, we, I didn't know, he didn't know what was going on through our mind. And we have a pact between us to say that if we are on the mountain alone, then we must still communicate and tell the other that, you know, one is all right. Because the one who's on the mountain is still okay, but the one who's waiting behind uh, to see what's happening is the one who suffers really because you can't communicate and he was carrying the satellite which was one way only he could call and we could receive so I cut off everybody's phone calls and I said nobody's going to call me I'm just waiting for the satellite call which never came for 48 hours but you got the call in the end Finally, and that's yes. the great story so the great story there is a meet in our midst all this grief there's reason to smile and Sangeeta you brought a smile on our face MJ I've got Appreciate you joining us. Uh, I guess next time you've got to be at the right place at the right time. 